Chapter 22, number 4. The drawing shows the type of flow meter that can be used to measure the speed of blood in situations when a blood vessel is sufficiently exposed, example during surgery. Blood is conductive enough that it can be treated as a moving conductor. When it flows perpendicularly with respect to a magnetic field as in the drawing, electrodes can be used to measure the small voltage that develops across the vessel. Suppose the speed of the blood is 0.34 meters per second and the diameter of the vessel is 4.6 millimeters. In a 0.98 Tesla magnetic field, what is the magnitude of the voltage that is measured with the electrodes in the drawing? In this problem, you're given the speed of the blood running through the vessel, which is 0.34 meters per second. And you're also given the B field or the magnetic field, which is 0.98 Tesla. And lastly, you're given the diameter of the vessel, or L, which is 4.6 meters millimeters, or if you want to convert it to meters, 0.0046 meters. So this is your given. Your next step is to find an equation that involves all three of these values in order to find the magnitude of the voltage or in this case we'll call it the electromotive force or EMF which is denoted by this symbol. That stands for EMF, electromotive force. So now, the equation that relates all of these values that we have in this problem is E equals to B V L. So electromotive force equals to magnetic field times the velocity times the length. So you substitute the values that you have into this equation. B is equal to point nine eight Tesla times V is 0.34 meters per second times L is 0.0046 meters. Then you plug it into your calculator. The answer that you will end up getting is 0 0.0015 and the units for electromotive force is volts. So that's the answer.